So we start off with this couple of games with a game against West Ham away. London Stadium it is, isn't it? That's odd. I just can't believe that West Ham ever moved away from Upton Park. Um, they were sitting behind the ball. We attacked them. They broke. They got the shot away. Very firmly pushed away there by Unsane. And then we attack them again. Raskin now. Under pressure from West Ham. Looking to pass the ball on. Forced away to the far side. Wrench to David Ashley. David Ashley now looking to take on his man. Get deliver the ball. Into the area. Headed away by West Ham. Chalabar to Raskin. To Vaca. But back heel to Raskin sets himself for the shot. He gets good voltage on it. Not very far away, but wide she goes. Raskin did really well there just to get distance between him and, him and the ball, setting himself for the shot before the West Ham defender closed in. This time, David Ashley feeds the ball forward to Esposito. Esposito to Chalabar with a shot that held by the West Ham keeper. Comfortable for him there, falling away to his right. West Ham come away with the ball, robbed by Raskin. Vaca now with a shot, that's wide, that's not very far away either. Very firmly struck. Raskin did really well, just got across there, won the ball. Fed Vaca, dispatched toward goal with authority, but wide. West Ham ball forward and again this time releasing the runner on the far side who's in Felipe Anderson didn't understand quite why Felipe Anderson took the time to do a little shimmy before striking the shot thought perhaps he had the time and the space to get the shot away before that but anyway Chalabar put through with a really good ball and a very good one-handed firm save by the West Ham keeper there to deny Chalabar. That was a really good opportunity. Caught it well, but West Ham keeper saved to keep it nil-nil at the break. Leeds get the game underway. Second half, left to right. At the London Stadium. <laughs> I just can't believe that. Upton Park was so synonymous with West Ham, wasn't it? Just seems very odd. Very odd. I get money talks in the game. I get stadiums are expensive. Anyway, Leeds attacking. Feeding the ball to Vaca. Very good save by the West Ham keeper. We keep kept the ball alive, but we couldn't make anything from it. And... Um, in the end we get a throw in and Chalabar now oh what a goal that is what a strike that is finally we can hit the front West Ham were very very dogged they just sat behind the ball I cut quite a bit out where we just kept the ball and West Ham didn't want to move but we ended up getting the throw in fed it to Chalabar and that is a fine strike to put Leeds ahead he caught it really well and it flew in all setting up a little bit as he took it and then steadied itself in front of him and then he connected with that right foot striking through it and delivered it past the keeper for 1-0 Leeds United attacking again the defender and the goalkeeper getting an awful mess but unfortunately we couldn't profit from it West Ham managed to scramble it away and um, and then we pick up on it again from the long ball forward. And then we feed Esposito. And another good save from their keeper. He's made a few good saves in this, this, this game and he's needed to. Esposito put clean through there. Getting a clean right foot strike firmly and low. And the keeper did really well equal to it. Chalabar wins the ball. He's having a good game. 
wait for Esposito to move over that far side feeds in the ball Levera now Levera I just felt that was a bit wrong Levera stepped around his man and, and he just got caught and the game just said yeah he can do that and I was just thinking no he can't in the end the shot goes wide after deflections so we get a corner and eventually we get the ball Levera to Chalabar Chalabar again Having a go, you might as well have a pop your looks in in this game, son. But West Ham get bodies in the way of it. Attacking again. Chalabar moving the ball on the far side to Pavlidis. Pavlidis ball in. And West Ham get a bit lucky there. Could have gone anywhere, that one. And in the end, they come away with the ball centre circle nice little quick pass in between them as they shift into positions and get this you know forward but in the end the shot is very comfortable for Unsane and he holds it Kasunu trying to get the ball across is caught out and uh, and then he has to clean up his own mess which he does thankfully Pavlidis there uh, playing on the left hand side for me Eventually, ball through to Esposito. Oh, what a strike that was. Lucky West Ham. Once it comes off the post and it's the keeper, it can go anywhere, can't it? But he dived on it. Goya Lipu feeding Esposito. Again, hitting the keeper. And again, the keeper just collects that. Pepper in the goal, but not getting anything. Hitting the woodwork. We're knocking on the door, but the goal isn't answering, is it? Koyalipu put through. Koyalipu with a good chance. And it's 2-0 now. Knocking on the door persistently. We get our reward. 2-0 Leeds United. 86 minutes. You would think that is it now. Nearly 87 minutes. There'll be a bit of injury time, but... West Ham sitting behind the ball. That's all they did. Like I say, I had footage that we just passed it around, but I had to cut all that out. Koyalipu there, put it, put through, cuts in from that wide position in toward goal. And he puts it past the keeper near post area, just flicks the right foot at it, good finish. Ball forward from West Ham now. Koyalipu to Yalal, Yalal, ball forward to Esposito, saved by the West Ham keeper again. A couple of minutes injury time, but that is it. Referee calls time on that. Three points in the bag. We'll take that back up to Yorkshire. Thanks very much. West Ham outplayed today. There's all the stats, very outplayed. Look at that shot count. Chalabar took man of the match, he had a good game. There's match day 16 results. And it's 8 minutes 50 at the time that I'm reading the counter for this video. So what I had to do was make a decision. Do I want to get this game on this video or do I want to separate it and make it put it on another video i want to get it on this video so what i did was uh, as southampton get the shot away early doors i made a decision to just cut this game a lot so that's what i've done so unfortunately you're not going to see the chances like that one i've cut them all and i've, I've put i've gone for the goals so here we are attacking west Ham win the ball um, I come away with the ball and break runner on the far side there as you can see he's played into space that little angle ball through that gap takes a touch sets himself for the shot and puts Southampton 1-0 up this actually looked a really good game and it's very sad that I couldn't get all the um, all the footage on because both sides had to go at each other and um, it looked a really good really good game this one so um, Either I want two games on a video or I separate them. 
you know because I do 15 minutes in a match when I actually play it so when I'm playing this this particular save I've got 15 minutes and then I've only got one 15 minute video to get games on so I have to take the highlights and you know from a 15 minute game you can get a lot of highlights as, as my videos are proven so it's like I had to just make a decision just put a lot of this game out so here we are they take the lead with a very good strike on the break and um, that's half time second half we get a free kick and Oscar Rodriguez delivers an absolute peach to put a 1-1 yeah Medic Mania was delighted with that yes he was Rodriguez goes away to celebrate with the crowd. Postage stamp stuff from Rodriguez there. Top left hand corner. Beautiful. Really good free kick from Rodriguez. That is his speciality, his party piece. That's what he does. 80 minutes on the clock now. It's a very tight game. Both teams have been having a go at each other. And eventually the ball falls to De La Vega, flicked on and through with Vaca, who scores. I think he's on as a substitute in place of Rodriguez in that position. Just left the legs is all it was. Because we'd gone into an attacking, um, you know, attacking mode, we were attacking them. Because I wanted the three points. And so I just needed fresh legs. We were, we were making progress in the game. And, you know, let's say both teams were having a go at each other. But Vaca there put through with a little back heel. Just touched on. Keep it flowing. And then Vaca, just edge of the D, just arrows it into the corner all along the deck. Lovely finish. Really good strike on it. Hit it really cleanly and true. Doing really well, Vaca. Keko to Guai. Guai forward to Koyalipu. Koyalipu now. That is too far away from its target. Pavlidis goes down chasing it. De La Vega picks it up. De La Vega now. Looking to twist and turn. Trying to find a bit of space. In the end gets the pass away to Guai. Guai is closed down. Drag back. Gets the shot away. Creates space for himself. Good work from Guai. Yalal now, Yalal backflip to Vaca, Vaca now, with a strike and finds the net, and that is 90, 94 minutes, the clock is saying, 94 and a half minutes, and Leeds United 3 1 up, points in the bag. Definitely points in the bag at that stage. Plus 4 minutes being shown in injury time, we're in the 4th minute. We're 3 1 up now. Lovely stuff. Left foot, Vaca again brace for him in this game since coming on as a substitute in the corner again same corner isn't it and then as we kick off there is no more time the injury time has been played out a 3-1 win and three points in the bag get in unfortunately the match was butchered in the edit um so you don't get to see what a, what a good game that was. Very entertaining game. You can see there from the shot counts, both teams really had a go. This game was, Southampton played their part in this game. Results are coming up soon, and then that'll be it for the video. So I shall see you for the next game. Take care.